Hey everyone, welcome back to the Cloud Pilot. I hope you all are doing well. Today I'm excited to share with you my journey of passing the prestigious Google Cloud Professional Machine Learning Engineer certification. In this video, I'll not only walk you through the exam details and content, but also share my personal experience and the strategies that help me succeed. If you're pursuing a career in tech, make sure you subscribe to my channel for more insightful content. Let's dive in. The Google Cloud's Professional Machine Learning Engineer Certification is designed to assess your skills in various aspects of machine learning engineering. The exam covers the following key areas. Framing machine learning problems, developing ML models, architecting ML solutions, automating and orchestrating ML pipelines, designing data preparation and processing systems, monitoring, optimizing and maintaining ML solutions. The exam costs around $200 and has a duration of two hours and you'll need to answer 60 questions within this time frame. Before we get into the details, let me give you a quick background about myself. I've been deeply involved in Google Cloud services for the past two years and had a role as a cloud infrastructure and DevOps engineer. This prior experience had linked to a strong foundation, but since I hadn't extensively worked with data and ML services, I had to put in a lot of extra efforts to grasp the machine learning concepts. My preparation journey for this certification lasted around two months because I was parallelly preparing for a couple of other certifications as well. So here is the approach that I followed. First is to understand the exam by visiting the official Google Cloud Professional Machine Learning Engineer page to get an overview of the exam scope and requirements. Go through the exam guide in detail to understand what specific topics and concepts will be covered in the exam. And then you can deep dive into the GCP services by exploring the Google Cloud's platform documentation to gain a clear understanding of each of these GCP services. And this knowledge is really crucial for the exam. Work on some hands-on experience, as I mentioned, no technical certification in the world will be useful for you if you don't know how to implement it in a real world scenario. So work on practical scenarios by following Cloud Skills Boost Labs, where you can gain some scenario based questions that will prepare you for each of these situations. And this will also solidify your understanding and help you gain some practical skills. As someone relatively new to machine learning, I found the exam to be quite challenging. However, my dedication to learning ML concepts and a consistent effort played a significant role in my success. Some questions were answered based on intuition and my familiarity with Vertex AI and its components had proved invaluable. Despite my initial lack of confidence, I managed to pass the exam. The questions were focused heavily on Vertex AI and covered various machine learning concepts like underfitting, overfitting and parameter tuning. The exam's difficulty level was comparable to the data engineering exam but I'm happy that I succeeded. Here are some of the resources that greatly contributed to my success. Satish Vijay's awesome GCP certification report, Google Cloud Platform's documentation, Cloud Skills Boost learning path, practice questions on Google Cloud, Google Cloud Machine Learning Certificate course on Coursera, Machine Learning Crash Course on Coursera by Google Cloud, as well as Vertex AI documentation. And also remember, practice is key. So once after the exam, I received my certificate in a few days and this is how it looked. And that's a wrap. Passing the Google Cloud Professional Machine Learning Engineer certification was a rewarding experience and I am excited to share my journey with you all. Remember, with the right strategy, resources and determination, you can conquer any challenge in the tech world. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Cloud Pilot for more content. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.